It was pet mania this weekend in New York City with two animal-inspired events, including Dachshund Day, where dog owners and their dolled-up dachshunds gather to celebrate this dynamic breed. It's a non-competitive gathering um, of dachshunds, uh, dachshund lovers, and um, basically people just come out and meet and greet with their dogs. They're long, lean lines. They come in many shapes and sizes and colors, and they're independent thinkers. They are extremely playful and lovable. They're the only breed uh, bred to hunt above and below the ground. Uh, as a puppy, he used to take the toilet paper and run around the house. So he would get into a lot of scrapes. We live across from a pet store, and so uh, we saw her in the window and had to have her. Well, her name is Dottie Sue, and we decided this outfit is really fit for her because she's a hot dog. I think I loved Dachshund since I was a little girl. So when it was time to ready to get a dog, I saw him in the window and I couldn't resist. This is Chippy, my little Dachshund friend. In two months, Tippy's going to be 17 years old and I'm the luckiest pet owner. Also, Petco's annual hamster ball derby took off this weekend with the fastest rolling rodents around. Pet owners cheered on their hamsters, gerbils, and mice as they raced down the tracks in hopes of crossing the finish line first. I'm here for the hamster ball derby. This is my pet Lolo, and I guess she's about eight months old. She really likes to run. I hope she has a lot of fun, and if she wins, I'll be really proud of her. She'll get more hamster yogi treats. Uh, we're here to win a hamster ball derby. This is our first year having a hamster. He's one year old with a good healthy diet of uh, hamster food, and occasionally he, he splurges too, a potato chip here and there. We're ready to win a race. 